Hi everyone, this is Tran Bowie live in Roswell. So it has been nearly a week since the coronavirus hit close to home here. And we saw a lot of school closings and the huge impact that it's had on our community. And what we're learning is that we're all trying to navigate our way through this new norm. And joining me now is Mike Thomas, who is the um, owner of Wild Slice Pizzeria and also the co-founder of a really great, what I call a movement, the School Meal Program. So Mike, thanks for joining us. I know it's like eight o'clock, you put the kids to bed, you finish school, how's it going? Yeah. And so a lot of people kept going to the gym and gym owners like Rick Banks at SFX Fitness took precautions and Rick is now with us live from his fitness center. Hi Rick, thanks for joining us today. We are entering week two of in-home learning, online classes, and teleschooling. So we have heard a term during this coronavirus crisis that has actually impacted our families, our lives, and our community. Yes, I'm talking about social distancing. That's where they say to stand back, stay away, and go home. Joining me now is Andy Williams, who is the executive director of Visit Roswell. Andy, for someone who this is your job to get people out and about, this has got to be tough. Thank you for joining us tonight. We are live because we are keeping our social distance. Um, so the big news today is that we are having to postpone the largest fundraiser of the year. Um, we knew this was coming. Um, yeah, that's Daniel at Johnny's. Um, that was great. He took 50 pizzas up to a hotel tonight that serviced Esther Jackson's families. Um, and we let him know it was there and he had a chance to get all the kids, you know, and see all the kids. The biggest thing I think for us has, has been the total shift in messaging. Um, you know, we, for the past year, uh, have been extremely aggressive in being out there and being, being front facing uh, and convincing of people to come into Roswell to uh, not only book group business, but uh, from the leisure side as well. And that's shifting. SFX has been here for 13 years. And I think we're part of this community. There's no think. We are part of this community. And I love giving back to the community. And there's a few other things I'm thinking about doing that's going to give back to the community. But yes, you don't have to be a member to even log on our Facebook page and be part of these classes. I would just encourage everybody um, to, to, to show some grace, um, show a lot of patience, and understand that, you know, we're all in this... Um, in this situation, and it's certainly unprecedented. I just like scrolling through and seeing all the cute animals. Like, I know. It makes me, me cute. <laughs> I know. I just can't. I'm looking forward to the day that we can go back and cuddle with all of the cats and dogs again. You oh, know, I would love it. 